For the past three years, I've stuck with this simple wardrobe solution that is I only wear clothes that are either in black or in white. Okay, I know what you're thinking. Yes, I wore these pants in the Day in My Life video, but this is an exception and we'll just gloss over that. The real question that you might be wondering is Why are you so boring? The real question that you might be wondering is why I only wear clothes that are in black or white. And I'm gonna explain to you how I've slowly fallen in love with my minimal yet monochrome wardrobe. The reason why I love my minimal yet monochrome wardrobe is because of three things. It's versatile, it's cost effective, and the most important reason being I'm purely being lazy. I feel like most of the things that I own and the things that I do is somewhat derived from being lazy, but I'm not complaining. It's just an observation. There's a thing called the Pareto's Principle or the 80-20 rule and the basic outline is that 80% of the consequences comes from 20% of the causes. I looked it up on Google. For example, 80% of your happiness comes from 20% of the things you do and 80% of the clothes that you wear comes from 20% of your wardrobe. Four years ago while I was decluttering my closet, I donated all my clothes that I didn't wear or I didn't plan to wear in the near future and what was left was clothes that were either in black or in white which were the clothes that I wore almost 80% of the time. So first, let's talk about the versatility of my wardrobe. I know there's only two colors, which is quite boring, just like myself, but there are four types of color combinations. So black on black, black on white, white on black, and white on white. It's a little confusing, I know. Also accounting for the style of clothing that I own, from oversized to very oversized to a tighter fit, I have combinations of clothes that work well for spring, summer, autumn, winter, and formal occasions, which is rare for introverts like me because I rarely go out. Because of the minimal amount of clothes that I own, it also saved me a lot of money, which brings me on to the second point, which is cost effectiveness. I didn't realize that buying clothes were that expensive until I started using my own money to buy clothes. So thank you mom and dad for buying me all the clothes. Since college basically ate up my bank account, every time I buy new clothes, I have to think extra hard about do I really need this or is it just an impulse purchase? I decided to not buy new clothes at all until I really need to. As long as they are still clean, they don't smell and they're comfortable, I'll continue to wear them. And again, the main reason that I want to save myself from all these trouble is I'm being lazy. Speaking of lazy, having this minimal wardrobe actually saved me a lot of time and reduced something called decision fatigue, which is something that I just found out while typing the script and I have to Google what decision fatigue is to sound a bit more intelligent when in reality, I'm just talking bullshit. Decision fatigue is the idea that a person's ability to make decisions degrades after making a lot of decisions. So having this limited number of clothes freed up a lot of time, especially in the morning if I'm going out, I can sleep for another 30 to 40 minutes instead of waking up and choosing what clothes that I need to wear because I only have a certain amount of clothes that I can wear and the combination's already there. My clothes go well together so I don't really have to think too much about what I have to wear and that saved me a lot of time. As college students, we don't really have enough time to sleep anyways so might as well spend that extra 30 to 40 minutes sleeping instead of going to your wardrobe and picking up clothes that you have to wear for like an hour or two when you could be sleeping in your bed. I prefer to spend my time and effort on things that really matter to me. At the end of the day, clothes are still clothes. They don't determine who you are or what your value is. I'm really glad that I have this minimal and monochromatic wardrobe. I've reduced a lot of waste, saved a lot of time, and prevented myself from excessive spending on materialistic items that don't bring any value to me. Most importantly, I can continue to be a lazy human being, with this laziness actually benefiting me in some degree. The only place where I would pay a little more attention to is shoes because I think a shoe can tell you a lot about a person, like how they've taken care of it, and generally it's the first thing people notice in an outfit if they actually cared. But even so, all my shoes are either in black or white. I have my daily beaters, which are my Vans. I wear my white Air Force Ones every now and then because they look clean and they go well with basically any outfit. And this pair of Converse high tops that I wear on special occasions like going out on a date. The last thing that I want to say before I end the video is that I just don't see the need to impress people with the clothes that you wear. The next time you spend an hour or two picking out an outfit, just remember that a lot of times people don't really have the time nor the effort to care about what you're wearing. 
because they're probably too busy worried about themselves and how they look as well. And I guarantee that the only time people would notice what you're wearing is when you're dressed like absolute sh**. Anyways, hope you guys can take something out of this video. Maybe clean out your closet, pick out the things that you don't wear or you don't plan to wear anymore, and donate them to someone who really needs it and who can make good use of it. Anyways, that's it for this video. Hopefully, I'll see you guys soon. Bye.